That fine chocolate brother right there? Oh, that's Calvin. Educated, with a nice profession in the technology field. Well-rounded guy. Plays hard, works hard, and loves hard. One thing's for sure, he loves him some Vanessa. Vanessa? She'll do anything for Calvin. Between work, school, and her love for music, she puts Calvin at the top. Even dropped out of college for a few semesters when they first met. She's loyal, trustworthy, and fine. Oh, it's Filet McNaught. <laughs> right. No, just something. Like Filet McNaught. <laughs> <laughs> so, babe, you got graduation coming up in about eight weeks. What you planning on doing after graduation? I mean, we'll be in the same apartment for like forever. Oh. Uh, I mean, don't you want that? If you told me these answers, mm. what? What would uh, happen? Let's just say somebody else will be. Really? <laughs> I'm not even going to say that, but. Uh. Oh. You know what, Vanessa? This, I can't do this. I can't do this at all. What? What? What kind of work is it? I it's mean, what? Not, oh, it's not work. I'm talking about us. I can't do us. Just, <laughs> it's not working out for me. Um, I just, we don't have a connection. And that, that doesn't work for me. I need a strong woman, and you just don't fit that mold. I care about you. Like, I'm here, I'm, we're doing this together. I feel like at least, you know, you having about eight more weeks left of school, um, I'm not trying to renew this lease. So I feel like after you graduate, let's just go our separate ways. don't understand where this is coming from but if that's if that's what you want fine oh okay Calvin think he's slick roommates huh Calvin out there wilding out now partying staying out late getting bent making new friends so what are your plans for this weekend I was thinking maybe Mount Charleston or skiing or something oh, okay you ski she is cute though. Mm. He cute. Really? Yeah. Mount Charleston skin. Hot cocoa, hot tub. Mm. Let's make it hot. So you would date her? That's what you like? You seen her come in just like I did. Yeah. That's I what would, you like? I, I like you better. Mm. Right answer. Oh, how's it going? Shanice, this is my roommate, Vanessa. Vanessa, Shanice. Hi, how are you? Whatever. She just gonna see. Well, you seen what she looked like. I see, but that girl just walked in the house and did nothing. Well, it's his house. Uh, the, so you saying you would do that? I'm saying if you only bring in nine dollars an hour. Hey, hey. I cannot believe this. Ugh. Ooh, I'm so mad right now. I can't believe this is happening to me. I've been good to him. Even though we broke up, we still live as if we didn't. He got a whole lot of nerve even inviting her over. Who is she? Ugh. Hold up. Let's try that again. Oh, how's it going? Shanice, this is my roommate, Vanessa. Vanessa, Shanice. Hi, how are you? Hi, Latrice or Benice or whatever he just said. Calvin, I am so tired of you. <gasps> Ooh, this is 
about to go down. <laughs> he, he know what he doing. He know what he doing. Look, I cared about you and I've been here. I'm not just a roommate and I'm so tired of you testing me. You test me every time. And, and you, you think I don't time. know this? I'm available, baby, call me. What don't worry, I'm not the chase her. Talking about I ain't motivated. Please, whatever. You know I'm the best thing that ever happened to you and you know it. I'm so, I'm so done with you, Calvin. What are you talking about? I'm just, I'm over it. Ooh. Yeah, now that's what it's supposed to be. Vanessa, open the door. I'm so over. I'm through, okay, Calvin? Go talk to Bernice. Her, her name is Shanice. Whatever! But... Damn, Vanessa, where's that been? I had to bring a stallion in here to get here and, and rev up her engines. That's good. If I would have had that at the beginning, Shanice wouldn't even have been in the picture. But she was cold. Yeah, call me Calvin. Why would he think? That it's okay to bring another woman in my house. I pay just as much rent as him. As a matter of fact, more now because you know that that bonus that I have got. But the point is, you don't bring another woman in the house with your ex or whatever. We sleep in the same room, so it's the same thing. You gonna bring another girl over to the house? Just the hell. The hell if you are. Not my house. I don't think so. I can't say, looking at her, I can't say he's wrong for this. What? Looking at her. Comfortable neither. Oh no, of course not. He ain't supposed to be. That's the point. He shouldn't have had no Shanice up in the house. No Shanice in the house. No Shanice in the house. Okay? Then you won't be sleeping on the couch. Open up the door. Ah, uh, you want okay. Alright, you wanna be stupid? I'm gonna be ignorant then. I'm about to sleep right outside the door, and as soon as you wake up to go to the bathroom, I'm getting this goddamn bed. He didn't, didn't even do nothing. What do you mean? He, if he, you he didn't do anything? It. What uh I play fucking Rick too. Got that big ass king size bed. I like you gonna be the only one sleep with the bed. Because I play Rick too. So having another girl on the couch. Okay, so how about I have someone over? Who Jeff? Who's Jeff? <laughs> Why does it have to be Jeff? Just Vanessa really stuck it to Calvin. Calvin was feeling her wrath and suffering the consequences of his actions. Yep, he shouldn't have had no Shanice up in the house. Why did I come home and there was another woman on my couch? Test me like that. I thought Calvin was a nice... Mama. Mama, let me, let me call you back. Oh, now isn't that sweet? We brought roses. That's gonna work. You know, these are my favorite. Yes. What do you think? Do you think this relationship is going to last? I don't know. Over the course of, I don't know, the last couple of weeks, and asking you about what you want to do with your life and all that, you just seem to, like, not have a plan. I mean, he made a mistake. I don't make big mistakes oh, like so, oh, oh, so that's the only time you're supposed to buy roses is if you, you fuck see, up, right? You, you see, it's working. Oh. I didn't care about her. I didn't even do nothing with her. Because mm, I walked in the door. She easy. How she gonna how, forgive him. You lucky these are my favorite. No. You ain't never bought me roses though. I ain't never had to. <sighs> what do you mean you ain't never had to? <laughs> and do me a favor. What's up, baby? Can you gonna warm me up some of them pretzels? You and those pretzels. They so good. That's is that all you want? Those pretzels are good. I, I had one the other day. Mm-hmm. Cause you ate the last one and didn't tell me. Gonna eat the last damn pretzel and don't tell uh -oh. nobody. Wait a minute, did, whoa, that's a ring. This fool on proposed to the girl in the kitchen. What's wrong with that? He put the ring in the microwave? Who does that? I would've stopped at the roses. Oh, you wouldn't have proposed? He just got a ring, they just, he just had an engagement ring. That's all we do to buy time. What? 